Want to pull your Asana tasks straight into Airtable? In this video, I'll show you how to connect the two using the Data Fetcher extension. We'll import tasks, map custom fields, and even set up automatic syncing. First, open your Airtable base. Go to Tools, Extensions, Add an Extension. Search for Data Fetcher, click Add, then Add Extension. Sign up for a free account with your email or use your Google account. If you already have an account, just sign in at the bottom of the screen. Once logged in, click Create your first request. In the application dropdown, choose Custom. This lets us build a custom API request for Asana. In the URL field, enter the Asana API endpoint for getting tasks from a project. We've also included this in the description so you can copy and paste it directly. Now replace project underscore ID with your actual project ID, which you'll find in your Asana project URL when viewing the project in your browser. Just copy the ID from the URL and paste it back into Data Fetcher. Let's rename the request to import Asana tasks so it's easy to keep track of later. Now let's set up the parameters. In the parameters box, click add. For the first parameter, enter opt underscore fields. This tells Asana which details from each task to return. In the values box, enter the list of fields you want to include. For example, task name and custom fields. We've added this list in the description so you can simply copy and paste it. Next, click add again to create a second parameter. This time, enter limit. The limit controls how many tasks are returned per request. For now, set the value to five so we can test the setup. Next, let's set up authorization. Change the type to O-A-U-T-H. Then under Connection, click New. From the list, choose Asana. A new window will pop up. Just click Allow to give Data Fetcher access. Finally, open Advanced Settings. Scroll down to Data Transformation. Make sure Single Record is selected. Then turn off Combine Nested Object Keys. This makes sure Asana's custom fields come into Airtable as separate fields rather than all combined into one. Then just click Save and Run. Data Fetcher will connect to Asana and the response field mapping screen will open. Start by clicking Deselect All to clear everything, then map the fields you need. Let's start with GID and make sure it's set as a new field and rename it to ID. Now select Custom Fields 1 Display Value, rename it to Priority, and set the type to Single Select. We'll also rename Custom Field 2 Display Value to Risk and set the type to Single Select. Next, select the name field and map it to your existing name field. Finally, select the next page offset. When finished, click Save and Run. Data Fetcher will now create these fields in Airtable and import your tasks. To keep your Airtable tasks in sync with Asana updates, open Data Fetcher and scroll to Advanced Settings. Under Update based on fields, select ID. This makes sure records stay synchronized between Asana and Airtable. Next, let's scroll down to Pagination. Select Cursor from the drop-down menu. Set Cursor Parameter to Offset. Set Cursor Field to Next Page Offset. For Page Size Parameter, use Limit and set Page Size to 100. Click Save and Run, and all tasks from your project will be imported into Airtable. To make sure your Asana tasks stay up to date in Airtable, you can schedule the integration to run on a regular basis. For this, you need to upgrade to a paid Data Fetcher plan. After upgrading, open Data Fetcher, and under Schedule, click Authorize. A window will open, select All Resources, and then click Grant Access. Now toggle Schedule this request on and choose how often you want to sync. We'll choose hours for this example. Click Save to finish. Your Airtable base will now update automatically with the latest Asana tasks. And that's it. You've successfully connected Airtable to Asana. Now your tasks, priorities, and statuses flow straight into Airtable, where you can track progress, build dashboards, or link tasks to other projects.